Okay, today in Survival Guns, we're going to take a look at the Glock uh, 22. It's a 40 Smith & Wesson pistol, and this is the 4th generation. And you can tell the 4th generation because it has the uh, larger mag release here. We're going to show clear first off. So the Gen 4 has um, a much more aggressive texturing. So if your hands are wet or muddy or bloody or whatever, it's going to really um, you get a much better grip on the gun as opposed to the earlier uh, generations of the Glock pistol. It also has a, um, a larger mag release, much easier to, um, to release the mag under stress, stress and so forth. It also has replaceable back straps. Uh, this one has no back straps at all, which is really um, perfect for my uh, medium size hands. That's what it looks like uh, in the grip. So it's going to be a couple of millimeters um, less reach to the trigger without a back strap. And then the medium and larger back straps are for larger hands and it can com uh, accommodate a much larger range of uh, hands with the removable back straps. Uh, my particular uh, gun here has the extended uh, slide release, which turns it into a normal slide release compared to other guns. The, um, the normal Glock uh, slide release is just a flat piece of metal similar to that right there except it extends all the way across so I like to have that little ledge and it doesn't get in the way it's not like other extended mag releases and those go for those are easy to replace and they go for about 10 bucks all Glock parts the little the small parts are, are not that expensive at all it's not until you get to a slide or something you're looking at a couple hundred bucks uh, this one also um, is different than the stock model in that it has uh, Trigicon night sights and I really like these night sights because, because it has a really nice uh, white outline there's what the, uh, the sight picture looks like but this one has uh, green in the front and yellow in the back which is really nice for picking up let me shut the lights off and see if it's visible at all uh, you can see a little bit that the front sight is a really bright and the back is uh, yellow uh, in the darkness that really works really nicely and it's great for a bedside gun which I use it for um, because the night sights you can see them glowing and it's so easy to just grab the gun this is uh, one of the number one pistols used by police agencies all over the United States uh, the, the Glock Metal 22 with um, a 15 round magazine and 40 Smith & Wesson uh, here's a spare mag here and this one happens to have uh, uh, the, the old Talons, but this is the, actually the Winchester Rangers. It's all the same bullet, but it, that's an exceptional round, 180 grains, 15 rounds in the magazine. The gun weighs at 25.8 um, ounces empty and around 35, 36 ounces uh, loaded with um, 180 grain uh, bullets. So you're looking at about 35 ounces uh, loaded, which isn't that bad for a fully loaded 40 Smith & Wesson. Here's a real nice M3 Streamlight that I use, um, I mean uh, Insight that I use for the bedside gun, my time gun. That's a really nice package right there, very easy to turn on. It's got the momentary switch, the full-on light switch there. Um, this is just an exceptional gun. Uh, shoots rapid fire very quickly because of the short reset. So here's what the reset looks like. Pull the trigger, right to slide. When you release it, you can hear that click and then you can fire again right from there. So all you have to do is just do that little bit of movement and you're going to be able to fire this rapid fire. So that's a really nice package right there. It normally comes the 4th gen with uh, I believe three magazines. So once you buy the gun for about $600 uh, more with the night sights, you're going to have a really good, good accurate, fast, uh, powerful handgun. I uh, highly recommend the Gen 4 uh, Glock 22. Any kind of the growing pains with the Generation 4 Glocks have been since uh, remedied. So it's a highly dependable, highly reliable polymer framed uh, pistol. 15 rounds, 15 plus 1 in the chamber. You're going to have a lot of firepower in this uh, package. It has a 4.5 inch uh, barrel. This is in between the, um, the Glock 23 and the Glock 35. So that's it for my quick review of the uh, Gen 4 the Glock. 22 and 40 Smith and Wesson and it's a really uh, dependable reliable as you know all Glocks uh, are thank you thank you for watching uh, survival guns